What's up, YouTube, and ho ho ho! Merry Christmas! My name is Domino, and welcome to a Pokemon TCG opening. First, Merry Christmas to everybody. This video is going up on Christmas, and I hope you're having a wonderful day. I hope you're getting everything that you hope for, and I hope you're spending time with your family and spreading the cheer that is the Christmas season. Now, we haven't done a TCG video in quite a while. We've been doing Ultra Sun and Moon, and uh, this isn't really the video to talk about it, but uh, TCG just isn't going to be as easy as it has been for a little while. We might be able to get back to it, but I do hope that we enjoy the video that we have for us today. Um, since it is Christmas, I am in the giving mood. If you wind up leaving a comment on this video, um, the first several comments, I have many, many codes that I haven't used and I just don't play TCGO. So if you're interested in getting a code, leave a comment below that you enjoyed and I will drop you a code in the YouTube messages. If you're subscribed, I'll make sure to drop you two codes if I can figure out how to check if you're subscribed or not. Uh, but make sure you subscribe because hopefully we'll be doing some stuff here. Now, in today's video, we're going to be opening up to celebrate Christmas a Decidueye and an Incineroar Premium Collection box. We're going to be opening up both boxes, which means we're going to be opening up 12 packs, which is going to be really exciting. Again, it's been a while since I've opened. I haven't opened any cards since the last videos that we saw, which was our Crimson Invasion booster box right before Ultra Sun and Moon came out. So I'm very excited to get back to it. Um, as I said, we've been working through Ultra Moon, or we've been playing through Ultra Moon, doing everything in the game. If you haven't checked that out, I would highly recommend it. Um, today, no, excuse me, last week, episode 80 went up. We've had 80 episodes of that series and more to come this week. Now, what else? I don't know. I don't want to blab on. Uh, we can go ahead and jump straight into it. If you see the sweater that I'm wearing, which you would have seen a little bit in the thumbnail, um, it's a Charmander, Charizard, Charmeleon little uh, Christmas sweater. Uh, I really, really like it. And uh, hopefully we can pull something cool. So let's go ahead and jump to the pack cam where you can kind of see. We, we only have so much room. But you can see Decidueye here. And then, it, well, actually, you can see it. And then over here, you can see Incineroar. So we're going to be opening up both of those. First up, let's open up Incineroar. Uh, or excuse me, let's open up Decidueye first. Being that Incineroar is my favorite. So we've already opened up one of these on the channel, I think. I'm pretty sure. I don't know why, why we wouldn't have, but uh, you can definitely check that out. You can go back and search on the channel to find whatever pulls that was. I don't even remember, but... Um, Whoa, Mew! And Mew and Mewtwo. This is how you know I'm I'm rusty on this. I'm knocking over everything. Anyway, you know, when I when I went to buy these, the thought of, oh, I could get the full set never crossed my mind. Because why would I waste money on a Primarina set? Because Primarina is quite obviously the worst starter. Actually, you know what? Here's the gonna here's gonna be the deal. I just want you to let me know what your favorite um, Alola starter Pokemon is. Just let me know that in the comments below and that'll be, if you leave that comment, I'll make sure and get you a code as long as I have them left to give out. In fact, here we go. Here's some Decidueye. Actually, that's a really good code. Because um, <laughs> I get you a Decidueye in TCGO. Again, I'm in a very giving mood today. So... Here we have another one of these Jumbo Decidueye that we'll add back here. Then we have, of course, actually, I could finally make a deck. I have not done this in so long. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Bear with me. Bear with me. I'll get it back. I'll get it all back. So here we have Rowlet, Dartrix, and Decidueye, our full art Decidueye. Goodness, that we, that comes with this. We have our little Decidueye pin. Woo! I hope I can buff the, I hope I can bump the brightness post recording. I am recording this at night, which as I've said in past videos, I normally record these during the day. Uh, this is kind of weird to do. So we have six packs. What do we have? Guardians Rising. We have Sun and Moon Base. We have Steam Siege Breakthrough, Guardians Rising, and Evolution. So an older set for sure an older box for sure i think i bought these when that whole oh the gamestop sale that's when i bought these 
as I was saying, my favorite starter in this set, or in this generation, definitely Incineroar. Um, it was certainly not the one that we're not doing, because I just wasn't going to waste any money on that. So let's go ahead and I'm going to flip these like this, and let's get started with the Pokemon that we really don't like much. I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan. I'm not, I've never been a fan. Ooh, it has been a while since I've opened some cards. Let's see if I remember how to do this. Um, so, how about we go with a fire energy? Of course. Of course it's a water energy. Just to rub it in my face that I don't really like Primarina. So it's just going to give me all the Primarina Poplio stuff. There it is. There's the Poplio, of course. Of course there's the Poplio. Uh, I would love to pull something great. This would be be nice and exciting to come back to a Tauros GX, which I do already have one of. Actually, I probably have multiple Tauros GX. Next up we have Guardians Rising. This could be a really good... Can we have luck after not opening for so long? Is that even possible? I know we had had trouble... I'm gonna go with a Grass Energy. Darkness in. I know we'd had trouble pulling a full art. If I remember correctly, we haven't pulled a full art out of anything except like a our booster box in quite some time. I just realized, hold on, those are going in the wrong stack. See what we got here. Reverse Metang and a Sylveon. Oops, I got off center. Nice. So we're two for two. I hope that doesn't mean that we're about to hit Snoresville. Can we get more? Can we finally pull a full art or a hyper rare out of something other than our Crimson Invasion booster box? If, I've, if I'm forgetting about something, make sure you let me know if you, if you remember something that I don't remember. This is our breakthrough one. Whoa, pull two cards to start with. Why is breakthrough? Oh, I was definitely about to ask why breakthrough was all Kalos and uh, seemingly all Kalos and Anto Pokemon. Then I remembered <laughs> this is XY sets. I really hope that we can start doing more TCG again. Um, I think this depends on what happens in uh, 2018. This is Steam Siege. I do remember the last time we opened Steam Siege, I think that was when we got our full art Sycamore, which was, I mean, that's super hype. The XY cards seem to like us, even though we've only opened Sun and Moon card. A Magirna full art. Wow. Okay. Again, it's the non XY ones. I'm going to, or excuse me, the non Sun and Moon ones. I'm going to put this in a sleeve, even though I think I have one of these in my... And don't worry about the ones that don't have sleeves. They're going to go straight into straight into the trade binder. They won't get any damage. If I even wind up building a trade binder. I have a binder that I call the trade binder, but there's hardly anything in it. This is a this is certainly a merry christmas so far. Goodness gracious. All right, let's see what's in evolutions for us. Can we keep it up? That would be kind of wild if we could. We can keep if we can keep the luck that we've had so far going there's a charmander he never lets us down who remembers those days goodness gracious opening up freaking charmanders every other week we get to end with the guardians rising if we open another another ultra rare ultra rare it sounds weird to say that if we get another one in this pack if we get another one in this pack, uh, okay. All right, to stick with our Christmas theme, let's go with lightning. Oh, I, I should have, uh, all right. This is Guardians Rising, which is, yeah. These must have been released shortly after Guardians Rising came out because there's two Guardians Rising ones in each, each of Oh my gosh, a Tapu Koko GX. That's a four pull, whoops. 
Um, 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 can, what can do? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to set these regular GXs down in front. All right. If you made it this far, don't tell anyone. Shh, shh. Don't tell anybody. Uh, okay, here's what I'm going to do. What the heck? Why are these all different directions? Don't tell anybody. Shh. Here's an evolutions code. Here's a Guardians Rising code. Hold on, I want to keep one Guardians Rising. Here's a Steam Siege code. Here's a Breakthrough code. Oh, I want to hold on to that one. Here's a, I already gave you that one. And here's Sun and Moon. Woo! I'm giving them away. I'm going to hold on to that Guardians Rising, though. Because I know that one's valuable. So I'm going to hold that for uh, for a giveaway. For the giveaway. All right, uh, where did Incineroar go? Next up. We're gonna open this Incineroar box. This one, you can see it in all the cam. Whatever, I don't care. It's not like we're gonna pull a whole bunch of air packs, right? Oh, come on. So I want you to let me know, if you open TCG for Christmas, let me know what the best pull that you got was. I'm le Just let me know a whole bunch of stuff in the comments below, okay? Just leave like, 15 comments each. Every person watching this video, I want you to leave 15 comments. Does 15 comments mean that you would get 15 codes? Interesting. I think I'm just, I'm just blabbing at this point. Sorry for shaking the camera there. Also, sorry for taking so long to get these freaking packs out. So Incineroar, being by far the best starter of Gen, of Gen 7. Whoa. You guys also want that? You want that Incineroar code as well? Look at how bad I am at getting this stuff out. My goodness. Okay, well, here's our full art Incineroar. Oversized full art. And then we have these few. Litton. Horacat, Cineroar, Horacat, the one that didn't come through for us in the MLPB. Then we have our Incineroar pin. Again, really hope I'm able to get the brightness up on this video so you can actually see that pin, or excuse me, that coin and our Incineroar. Look at that. I'm telling you, he's by far the coolest started oh just in case you want it here is the Cineroar code all right uh let's toss that down so we got the same stuff as last time let's go ahead and shuffle it up so i get my arms back in place oh all right so we had four out of six packs gave us pulls still no full art or hyper rares from the sun and moon ones let's go ahead and jump in let's not knock off any path starting off with guardians rising just starting off with a bang can we pull a lele that's what i'm that's what i'm talking about merry freaking christmas would i give away a lele if i pulled it no sorry all right um grass there's no metal in Christmas. All right, I think I'm good. I think I'm all settled. All right, let's get through this. Ooh, I want to see a Komo'o. Komo'o's in this set, right? Yeah. Let me see a Komo'o. Not a victory bell. All right, next up is Evolutions. You want to give me a full art Charizard Y? I haven't pulled one of those in a while. I don't remember if I pulled mine on the... When did I pull mine? It's evolution, so... Focus, please. Thank you. Where's my evolution? Evolutions is... Oh! I put evolutions up there. I'm so lost, I don't even know what I'm on, what I'm doing. It's been so long. Good. 
gracious i really haven't opened pokemon cards in a month it's actually been a month actually it's been over a month reverse hollow rare energy that's nice and how about a mega blastoise ex keep it on i don't think that's one i don't have actually i'm not sure so i'm I'm not so sure if I have that one or if I don't have that one, but I'm going to go ahead and put that in a sleeve here. All right. Next up. Oh, I'm going to veto that Guardians Rising to the bottom. Because Guardians Rising is like the signature. The signature set, per se, of, this, of these boxes. And also, I turned on my heater when I got home a little while ago. And that thing is working. Because I'm burning up all right let's go with a fire energy because i'm burning up oh there's the grass energy it always alternates it's never the one i call it's always the one after the one that i call there's a pop leo again okay there's a dartrix that makes me feel a little better i'm not just being haunted and a two cannon all right i got three packs left so i'm gonna need all three of these to be ultra rares or decidui will definitively win the so-called contest what am i even opening steam siege no this is breakthrough i was like that's not steam siege stop being dumb <laughs> all right oh my gosh can I just, can I just, can I, oh my goodness, I have pulled two cards in every single one. Army, Reverse Smeargle, and an Aromatisse. Two more. Steam Siege it is. Is Mega Blastoise going to be the only pull? Incineroar, you know, you're dark typing. You like to play pranks, don't you? I think he likes to play pranks. What are we opening? I think this is steam seat oh god okay i think this is the right order i think this is steam seat. Let's find out i don't even i don't even know oh there's a sneasel i like me some oh god sorry i see some shining like a talon flame break i have not pulled a break card in so long and last up is an Avalos. I haven't pulled a break card in. Have I ever pulled a break card on the channel? Do I even have this card? That might be new. I'm going to sit that right there. And lastly, Guardians Rising. So will this be a two pull box? Will it be a three pull box? And I'd say it's still possible for Incineroar to pull off a victory if you're if you're comparing if you're comparing the two um i'm gonna go with a fire energy oh there's the lighting for all our christmas lights okay here we go last packs i'm gonna open for a while can it be anything good a hollow chandelure all right so let's see what we got wasn't bad at all so i think the order was like this and then like that so in our decidui box we pulled a tauros gx followed by a sylveon gx followed by a full art magirna ex followed by tapu coco gx then in our Incineroar box, we pulled a Mega Blastoise EX and a Talonflame Break. So, oh, wait, wait, wait. You know what? Never mind. That's all. <laughs> all right, I'm going to hold on to these. So again, if you watch the entire video, there's a couple things you can comment below. Either comment what your favorite starter in Gen 7 was, or comment what you got if you opened any Pokemon cards this year, or excuse me, for Christmas. 
um, today or this weekend or whenever your Christmas was. Um, or you can let me know what your favorite pull from this opening was and I will send you a code while supplies last. If you're subscribed and if I can figure out how to check that, I will also send you uh, an additional code. So you might be looking at two codes. I'm in the giving mood. Again, if you checked out this video, thank you so much for the support. I really appreciate it. I hope we can bring more TCG videos back to the channel. Life, life permitting, we will. I, Cause I love opening these up and I certainly hope that you guys enjoy watching it. Check out some of the other series such as our Platinum Severely Randomized Nuzlocke that just starts today with episode one actually. Later on today, you can check that out. Go back and check out our Ultra Moon playthrough as well. And we'll see you in the next Pokemon TCG opening. Until then, have a blessed day and a Merry Christmas.